We had a great week this week with a lot of accomplishments to shout out. Congratulations to our boys lacrosse team for beating Wando in the state championship last Saturday. It's amazing to see the hard work of our student athletes and how that led to the first ever state championship for lacrosse. Congratulations to Luke Letterhose and Pearson Harris for being selected to the North-South All-Star Game and to Coach Turner for being selected as the coach of the North-South All-Star Game. We had a great season. Our boys golf team won the region championship on Monday and set a new school record. Ben Mills, Justin Woj, and Tyler Kimmerlin were all region. They play in the upper state tournament on Monday at Springfield. Congratulations to both our boys and girls soccer teams for winning their first two playoff games and making it to the third round of the playoffs. The boys play tonight at Clover and the girls play tomorrow at Malden at seven. Our girls softball team is in the playoffs. They play tonight at TL Hanna. Good luck. Great job to our boys baseball team for making the playoffs this season. Our athletes of the week this week are girls lacrosse player Catherine Barhorse, who was named the region player of the year and our entire boys lacrosse team for winning the state championship. Our track team had an outstanding region meet on Wednesday. Mason Haynes, Mia Royale, Lucas Bars, Elise Davis, Amira Davis, Sierra Smith, Alicia Lucas, and Aubrey Barney are, are all region athletes. Our 4x400 team of Elise, Sierra, Alicia, and Aubrey set the school record in the 4x400 meter. 16 of our athletes qualified to run the upper state qualifier next Saturday, which is an amazing number. Last night, our chorus and guitar students had an excellent performance. They sound amazing, and I want to congratulate Ms. Trott and Dr. Ramsey on their leadership of these groups. We are blessed at Nation Ford to have so many talented students. Lastly, I want to congratulate our band for earning the Outstanding Performance Award from the South Carolina Band Directors Association. They earned this because their outstanding performances in marching band, all state and region band, concert performance assessment, and solo and ensemble performances. They are again one of the top bands in the state. If you want to see our outstanding students perform, they have a concert on Tuesday night at 7. We are three weeks away from the end of the year. Let's finish strong and I hope you have a great weekend.